Hi, I'm Tamara Lackey, and we're here in my studio in Durham, North Carolina. And one of the most common questions I get is, what are your favorite lenses and why? That's the most important part, why? It depends on who I'm shooting and what the objective is for the shoot. If I have zero idea of what I'm walking into, which actually happens more than you think, I'm gonna grab the 24 to 70 2 8 lens because when I have no idea what I'm walking into, I want a very versatile lens, and that's what this is. I have two people. I love the 85 14 lens for the ability to get really sharp, crisp, clean images where the background is just such shallow depth of field. It's beautiful. When I'm photographing a group or a family or any sort of collection of individuals that I am going to be shooting all of them together, I choose the 35-1-4 because it's not ultra wide, it's not super long, it's kind of just right to give me the look that I'm really going for. When I know I'm going to photograph just an individual, whether it's a child or an adult, and I want a very flattering portrait and I want it very, very sharp, I love the Micro 105. With the micro lens, I can get very close. The lens will adapt the aperture for me, and I can get the shot I was going for all along. I'm gonna grab the 7200 2.8 lens because it gives me beautiful, sharp, clean, crisp images. I have wonderful shallow depth of field ability, and I can stay away. I can keep some distance from my subject. This is absolutely my lens of choice for an excellent telephoto zoom, but another great alternative is the 7200 f4 lens. Another lens I've been having a lot of fun with lately is the 5814. First of all, I love that it's 58, I just love the differentness of it. Um, in addition, the 1.4, I've been shooting really tack sharp subjects with these soft, beautiful backgrounds. And for that reason alone, it's one of my new favorites. Of course, everyone has some sort of spending plan or budget, and I get asked a lot, where should I put my money as I'm growing in photography? And I always advise people to put their money into great glass, because lenses are about the best investment you could possibly make in your photography. Because at the end of the day, what do we all want? We want sharp subjects, we want beautiful color tone, we want soft backgrounds, and this glass provides you that.